Hmm? Oh, okay. That's my honey. He's whispering to me, guys. Hmm. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I'm back with part two. I, t I made the um the stuffed pizza for my kids. Now what I'm gonna do is my husband informed me that he would like a vegetable stuff, a vegetable deep dish pizza. So I'm gonna do him a vegetable. This is part two, vegetable deep dish pizza. Okay. Again, again, we have the same ingredients. I have um this is um uh, some Parmesan cheese, some basil some parmesan and some italian and i'm just going to mix that together and mix it through my bread this is going to be in my bread in my piece of dough and i love this and i even um incorporate jalapeno peppers in there but i'm putting some in the pizza too on the side of it some mal jardiner yeah yeah i just gave myself an idea my husband don't like um, hot stuff, but or mild stuff, but when you cook it in there, it kind of tones it down, evens everything out, especially when you have your savory and your sweet and your salty, all that savors together. It kind of mixes it, uh, plays it down, so you don't get that hot pop. So I'm I'm going to put some um, jardinier peppers in it, okay? So there you go. See that all my ingredients mixed in there. So I got enough flour over here. I don't need to add no more, I don't think. Yep, I got enough flour. And I I, I, I so enjoy this, guys. I so enjoy this, like a big kid. I was one of them kids that liked to play in dirt, so I enjoy this. So this is gonna be a deep dish pizza. And you see, I got my big girl out of my cast iron skillet back there. She should be dry by now. I'm gonna put some um, extra virgin olive oil in her. Okay. Okay. So we got her spread on now. Okay. All righty. All right, all right, all right. Let's put a little oil on her. Deep dish her, baby. Deep dish. Let's take her and let's put it in there. Whoa, she's gonna be delicious. The bread smells good too, guys, by the way. The bread smells very good. And you wanna, you don't wanna force her down. So I'm gonna lift her and kinda help us rest. I'm gonna lift her up and kinda help her rest down. You see I'm twisting her around there too. Cause I like a feet, I love a crust that's around the edges. And see I'm just twisting it like some of y'all do y'all hair. That's the thalas in me coming out, I'm just twisting it. I'm gonna incorporate my skills everywhere I go. You, 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 you understand me, you understand. There you go. With a little butter as well. But she has to pre-cook. She has to pre-cook. Because she's a stuffed pizza and because she's an open pie, she has to pre-cook, okay? So I have to pre-cook her for 15 minutes and let her get a little brown. And then I can add my ingredients to it because the ingredients are already ready. So she has to pre-cook. That's my butter. I'm adding that butter in there. And I shouldn't have to, I, I, I won't have to add any more butter. Okay? That's my butter. And there I'm finna have me a stuffed pizza, okay? See there? That's my stuff. You see the skillet? Now I'm gonna put her in there. And I'm gonna have to bring my rack down.
So she has to go on there for about 15 minutes. And once she comes out, I can put all my ingredients in her and put her back in the oven for about 15 minutes for everything to marry and get to know each other. You know, when they go in there in the refrigerator, I mean in the oven, and when they're on the top, that's when all the magic happened because I combined everybody together and I introduced this side of the family to this side of the family and I bring the, this side of the family over here to meet this and then we all get together and we marry and blend and make beautiful music in our bellies, okay? The oven so that we can, we can put our ingredients on it. Look at that, look at that. You see that? It's, let me bring it over here closer to you guys. Look at this, deep dish. This is finna be our deep dish pizza. It smells so good, guys. It smells so good. It smells like, I don't know. Uh, I'm from Chicago, so, you know, back in the day, we used to go to Giordano's Pizza right on the wall. I think it was Gino's, Gino's East. It smells like that. I ain't trying to take that steal their flame, steal their fame and their glory, but this pizza smells delicious. Yes, it does. It smells delicious. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some of my homemade paste in it. It's like the hot sauce commercial. I use this girl for everything. So I'm gonna add her on in there. You know, a pizza without sauce is just it's like a, a mannequin without a wig. Hello. You can come look, come over. Say hi. Hi. She's she's on a break. She raided up her pizza, guys. Mama's taking a little bit too long. So again, I want to add me just a little cheese at the bottom. I love adding cheese at the bottom. Now I'm going to add, now my husband and I, we're going to have vegetables, okay? So I'm going to add my vegetables to here, and this is what I have, my green, my red, and my yellow pepper. Well, no, I have green and yellow peppers, no red. But I did say, I did say, jardinier. We do want jardinier. Here is my, my mal jardinier pepper. I'm going to add me some of them. And these are the ones that you all saw me use on Christmas for my mixed greens. I added me some bell pepper and some celery and stuff up in there. Yeah, when the, when the peppers is gone, I always cut me up a little ingredient to put in there. So this is really not, it's not that hot. It ain't even mild because it's, it's my own concussion. But it's so good, guys. It is so good. Now I'm going to add... I'm gonna add me some onions and some garlic. Onions and garlic. And now I'm going to add, oh, I have me some, here I have some sweet kale mix. This is some sweet kale mix. And it has asparagus in it, Brussels sprouts. See the little pieces of Brussels sprout? I'm gonna cut that down some. It has small pieces of Brussels sprouts in it as well to cook consistent all the way through. So this is my sweet kale mix. This is my spinach mix right here. This has cabbage in it and everything. It has kale, uh, red cabbage, regular cabbage. I have spinach in it. Um, it has um, some carrots. Um, it has Brussels sprouts and asparagus, and this is my spinach. This is the vegetable pizza. And that is the vegetable pizza. And now we're going to add our cheese to it. But before we do that, I want to season it. I'm going to add me a little, um, the garlic and herb blend from all these, the cousins of Mr. Dash. Yeah, I got the cousins in on this. This is the original um, herb blend. I'm going to um, add me some salt free. I know you all have seen this before in the store, and it's a Creole, and I don't want you all to think I'm trying to be slick, 
But I added my, I keep adding my salt free in here because it's a nice size bottle. The salt free comes small. So I just keep adding my salt free in here. So this is salt free. I don't want you guys to think your girl is lying to you. We've come this far by faith. We come this far by faith. <laughs> oh, that was one of my favorite hymns when I was a little girl in church. This is my garlic bread sprinkles. And I'm going to add my cheese on my pie. And I'm going to add my parsley, Italian seasoning, and there you have it. She is going back in the oven, but I want to show her to you guys. Okay? Look at that. Bow! Doesn't she look beautiful? I know she do. We're going to put her in the oven at 400, okay? I'm going to say you Okay, guys, it is time for me to get my deep dish pizza out now, okay? Oh, MG. Oh. You guys see that? Do you see that? Do you see it? I know you do. Let me show it to y'all. Deep dish vegetable pizza okay this is for myself and my husband and my family they can have some too but look at that there is your homemade deep dish pizza and look how big the skillet is so you know this is a deep one right this is like an extra a extra deep dish pizza okay because it's so deep but here you go and it smells delicious okay so don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe don't forget to tell a friend about a friend and let everybody know that PMS made you do it, okay? And waste nothing. Waste nothing. The turkey that was in my stuffed pizza came from Thanksgiving. Those were my turkey breasts that I saved, okay? So waste nothing, okay? Waste nothing. Thank you.